the garden. That day her gaze went to the open door, the inky interior, charcoal black. It was as if she'd never seen it before, and her eyes, unaccustomed to the dark, pricked with stars, strangely drawn, but holding the ladder while he cut the vine, she stayed, noticing beneath her palms the rough-hewn wood, worn rungs, splinters. It made her dizzy to look up, as if the scene were in reverse, the sky a pool she might fall into. So she does not see what happens to him, how his hands grow stiff as twigs, does not notice as leaves sprout from his fingertips, nor the stillness that befalls him. Only when her hands hold empty air does she know, and then there's only birdsong.